Stopped your effortlessly All this free charge I just can't seem to see how I solve this problem Tearing through these books Getting so close What am I gonna do? It still doesn't look right No matter how I do these forms I just cannot find the answer Oh, 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 oh Ain't nobody does it better Need the free charge You sell the tea Ain't nobody does it better Del plus B is no surprise I do I deal with all these eyes Del plus B is no surprise It was Amber's law that Maxwell treasured The change in E he had to measure Ain't nobody does it better Leave the change in B during the video that Mike was waving his hand out uh, uh, over some lasers. So what that was, was that for this project we decided to build a laser hub just to sort of give a sort of visual demonstration of something electromagnetically related uh, to the uh, uh, Maxwell's work. So for that we found a project online and we decided to build it uh, using an Arduino and a stepper motor and a uh, MIDI output to export it to a computer. So I'll just uh, point out some of the components for you. Right, so first of all we've got the Arduino you know, uh, microcontroller. This uh, has code uh, already loaded onto it from the computer, uh, which we were able to find online, graciously provided in the instructable that we used to build this. So what this does is, this controls all of these uh, outputs, The uh, stepper motor, the laser which isn't connected up at the moment uh, and from uh, these outputs uh, obviously we break the laser and it's going to be picked up by an LDR here uh, and it can then take this output and convert it into a sound output. The Arduino sends signals uh, to this transistor which when the uh, voltage is applied to the base allows current to flow from the batteries to the laser uh, and at, whilst doing that the Arduino is also controlling the stepper motor so that the laser turns on for each position that the stepper motor is in so what we've done is loaded uh, four uh, positions onto the stepper motor so that uh, for each time the laser is turned on the, laser, the stepper motor is in a different position and if you were to break the beam when it is in a certain position, that is corresponding, that's picked up, the position is picked up by that Arduino 
and corresponds to a certain note when it's picked up by the LDR and the output is then taken from the Arduino as a MIDI file from the MIDI jack uh, which you just plug into a computer. Thanks very much for watching our video. We hope you enjoyed it and we hope it will serve you as a really good tool to help you memorise Maxwell's equations, especially in the run-up to exams. If you'd like to see how to build a laser harp of your own, follow the link below and that will take you to Instructables and you'll see the step-by-step -step instructions that we use to build ours. And feel free to let us know in the comments how you got on. If you haven't got enough of people being silly, follow the top link to our outtakes for our video and just have another good laugh at us being daft.